Look, she's nudging him to show him to go get some milk. Look, what a good mom. Oh my gosh. So they're about three hours old. Hey everyone, Katrina Stack here. Welcome back to my channel. So underneath here, if you guys remember, we always had babies. Well, finally today, baby girl had her babies. Look at them, so cute. Oh my gosh, we didn't catch the birth, but how adorable is his little sweet face and this one too, oh my gosh. So she must have had the babies in here because it is, whoa, it is definitely a little, uh, yeah, earthy. But check them out and they are so clean. I mean, if you guys can tell the last babies when they were born right away, they had like stuff all over them and they were like gooey because she didn't clean them. So these are probably about three hours old, I'm assuming. <laughs> but check them out. Baby girl, you did so good. Oh my gosh. Wait till I grab this other baby in the back. But check them out. I'm gonna show you guys the size comparison as well to, compared to the three week old babies versus a day or two hours. But let me grab this one so you can see how, oh my gosh, this one is just, what cute colors. Oh. How sweet is this one? Mm -hmm. It has a like, ew, yucky. But look, and what a good mama too. Look at this one. This one's like cream colored pink. It's so cute. And we have two boys. Oh, let me grab the other baby so I can show you guys the comparison size because baby goats grow so quick. And baby girl, you did so amazing. What a good mama. She's like, don't touch me right now. I just gave birth. I totally get it. How adorable. Oof. They're a little bloody, weird, gross. Can't get over this one, so sweet. And it's like pink, but we have two little healthy baby boys. You are so sweet and you have green eyes. Wow, you're so cute. Hi, baby. What a sweet little face. She is so sweet. Oh my gosh, hi. Look, she's nudging him to show him to go get some milk. Look, what a good mom. Oh my gosh. So they're about three hours old. This one's adorable too. But I'm just like really head over heels with this one. So guys, I'm going to grab one of Penelope or Petunia. It's so funny, Pickles is right over there. You guys could see her. And she just like lets the babies do their own thing while well, they are with their daddy. Hey Zeusy. But look, they're just like, we're hanging out. Mom just is over there eating always. Poor. I'm bringing them back over to mama so I can grab them and show you guys the size comparison to three week old babies. Oh, look, we're picky. She's just getting beaten up for that milk. Hi, mama. So right now I have little Penelope in my arms. Penelope is the one that Jackie named. I named Petunia. So we have Penelope and Petunia and I'm going to grab one of the babies, the newborn babies, because check it out. This baby's three weeks old and look how big. They get, so they grow so quick. They literally grow overnight. So let me grab a baby. Two hours old and three weeks old. Look at the difference, the size difference. Like I said, they grow so quick and overnight, but they almost look like they're related. They're so cute. Pickles had two girls, which I'm gonna go ahead and let her go. And baby girl had two boys. But there you go, put you back with your mama. Go walk her. Go back over, oh my goodness, babies. How adorable. So right now we have two moms that have given birth to really healthy babies as you guys can see and we have two more moms to go so I'm really excited oh my gosh this baby is just so sweet check him out look at his little face and he's not afraid at all he's trying to get some milk hi baby you're so adorable you want to try hey babe here babe here babe he has blood on his face but he is so cute I'm just in love with this little one you are adorable you are so cute you guys check it out here. Mama's kind of mad. Actually had five babies that were born on the farm as well. We didn't know that she was having them. And she just popped up one day and had five babies underneath her. But check them out. I'm not gonna open her cage because I don't wanna make her mad. But you know what's crazy about her? All the babies are underneath her. It's so funny. They're just like tucked underneath her. And she sat on someone else's eggs. So we have, she's taking care of Americanas and Rhode Island Reds. And I forgot what she is, but I will remember it in a minute. And I will tell you guys, but it's super cute and adorable. And we have more babies here. Just looking over at Rainbow, I was like, man, Rainbow looks uncomfortable. Look at the babies playing on their little playground. Whoop, 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 whoop. How adorable is that? They just love to climb on everything. Let me get a close up, but I think rainbows do next. Or there's, Buffy looks like she's just like about to probably give birth too. 
they're all kind of hiding. Whenever they stand away or seclude themselves, they usually go and that's like a sign. So let's see if we're gonna have babies in the next couple days. Cause we already have two moms down and two more to go. Right, Rain? Hi mom, are you ready to give birth? Are you ready to get those babies out of your belly? And I'm gonna give you guys a little goat show how cute they are. Zeusy, leave me alone. Hi babies. You wanna jump and play? They're starting to. Look, they're like, hmm, should we come over here? Let me try to move them. Look at their dad guarding. Whoops. There he goes. There goes Penelope. Go, Petunia. Whoops. <laughs> I love watching baby goats play. I'm gonna have to redo my old video of dressing all my baby goats up. Hi, babies. Go. Mountain goats. Put on a show for us, would ya? All right, guys, I just saw Buffy pawing at the ground. I think Buffy is literally going to give birth the same day baby girl did, which would be amazing. Buff, can I get close to you? Buffy's not one of the friendly goats. I mean, I've had her for over three years, three and a half years, but I think she's, are you gonna give birth, mama? Are you going to? Oh, she looks like she's, oh yeah. Are we about to push out a baby? Oh, no, we're peeing. But look at that milk sack. And she's staying away from her own pawing. I'm gonna try to feel it because once it's hard, it's not that hard actually. Hmm. But you never know. Look at her right side of her belly too. She's definitely going to give birth. I'm gonna try to catch it on film for you guys. And look how she's walking too. Oh, she looks like she's in so much pain. Wow. Tonight might be the day. I'm literally gonna camp out here all night because Carmine is harassing her and her right side, oh gosh, Zeus, why? He always has to do that to me, or everyone. So I feel like she's gonna give birth. I'm gonna try to catch it on film for you guys because how cool would that be? And Buffy, let's have babies already. And Susie, can you get off me? Rainbow just pawed, do you see that? Rainbow's pawing too, I wonder if she's gonna give birth too. Oh my gosh, I'm literally just following the goats around the pasture and seeing if they're gonna give birth. I may be here all night, oh goodness. She just pawed too. I'm literally just watching them paw and walk around so uncomfortably. Come on, girls. Zeus, quit being inappropriate. I'm like afraid to leave. Cause I wanna see, and they said it right up, like their backbone will be like sunken in. I just looked up all the signs that they're gonna give birth. And there's, there's discharge, I'm Buffy, and she's walking away from everyone. Come on, Buffy. Come on, girl. She keeps on moving away from the herd. I'm like slowly following her. Come on, Buffy. She is showing all signs that she's in labor right now. But labor can take up to 7 to 12 hours. So I'm just going to hang out with her. I think she's been in labor for the last couple hours. Um, I'm just trying to catch the birthing on film for you guys. So I'm trying to stay back. Let her, you know, walk away and not feel any pressure. And Zeus has been following me around everywhere in Carmine. Rainbow keeps on walking away as well. So I feel like she's in labor too. And Carmine usually harasses them. Like what he's doing now, and like follows them. So any day now, girls, any day. I am following Buffy because Buffy is walking away from everyone and isolating herself. And she's pawing, she's pawing, she's pawing. Oh my gosh. I wonder if it's gonna happen. Look, she's pawing again. Crap. Let's see if she falls in. She's pawing. There she goes. Early signs. More signs. I wonder if it's about to happen. She just pawed three times in a row. What that means? She's pawing again. Four. Rainbow's following her too. She paws again. Oh wow. There she goes again. How crazy would that be if two goats give birth in the same day? She's secluding herself even more. There she goes, pawing on the tree. I don't wanna like scare her. Oh 
she keeps on pawing, but the only thing I'm worried about is that they say at nighttime, when ghosts give birth, that it's not a healthy baby. So usually during the afternoon from 7 a.m. or the morning, oh my gosh, we were working on this fire and she just laid down. It's finally time. It's finally time. Rainbow just came in the den too. Oh my gosh, are we about to have two, three moms give birth in one day? Crazy, and there's so many ashes. Whew. Are you about to give birth? She's like, maybe. Then here's baby girl with her babies that are healthy and so cute. Baby girl, you did so good. Her water is breaking right now. Oh my gosh, I am catching it. And Carmine's standing over her. How crazy is this? Let me zoom in. She's about to 